Well, here we are at Mom's Wall. We'll have a masonry mortar finish to match that wall. Two by six footer. That'll get buried and covered up. Down to the tree. Whenever you can back butter your brick like this, it's superior to all other methods. That is superior. Well, here we have the start of a bollard connecting into the wall. Mortar responds well to troweling and scraping. When you're putting mortar, there's a couple techniques. You can back butter, you can front butter, or you can, I can't believe it's not buttered. Either one, just go with what's working for you. How about that one? That was nice. Always be paying attention to the mud. Make sure your wall's moist, it's gotta be moist. You can see my moisture line right here. So we're doing three feet worth. Step one, scrape the wall, prep the wall. Step two, wash the wall. Get your moisture just right. Moisture's important here. Take your mud a little on the thin side. And finish with the sponge. When you mud stones onto the bollard, make sure you start with wet blocks and a bed of mud down here at the bottom. And back butter your stone real nice. Well, this morning I'll do a little acid, acid washing that is, on the bollard. We'll pull some of our forms. 
I got a few high stones sitting up here. So we'll pull the forms and do some acid. Wet the stones and apply the acid. Well, here's the top of our bollard. We got the old world effect going on. We're mimicking a hundred year old wall. Trying to make it look like the stones have fallen off over the hundred years. You can see the effect the desert basalt has on the wall. It's a nice contrast in color. And a few more of the desert basalt stones as we go down the wall. Just a couple of floaters up high. A few formations down low, make it look like rocks have fallen off the wall over the years. Boulders are from on site. So are the kitties. Kitty, kitty. And the stone wraps around and comes all the way over to there. Well, here we have our old world bollard and the old world wall effect. Some of the artifacts and treasures we found digging. A few stones mimicking the wall is a hundred years old and they've fallen down over time. These ones are really neat, real colorful. Couple of big ones tying it all together. 